me. Hey there, it's Mark Pike back by another video review. Uh, it's Simon's from AK Rifle. But before I get into this, uh, I've got a girlfriend on camera today. She's helping out in the video. But on to the review, this I'm a Spring AK. Uh, the fact is, the Spring AK don't let it fool you because it's actually quite a good gun for the money that you're paying. The quality of it, I'm actually, for a Chinese gun, I'm actually quite surprised it's good. There is a few metal bits up on the body itself and the springs that Simon have used on the internals I actually think they're quite good because for a spring gun it does have a bit of kick when you throw the charging handle or when you fire it. Now I'll quickly go over metal components for you. Now, the charging handle itself is metal. The lower barrel here is metal and it's textured. The lower barrel here is metal. It's not textured, it's just plain, plain smooth, it's not one continuous lower barrel. Uh, metal rear sling hook, which is good. Um, the rest of the components and most of the components on the inside are all metal, including some pretty nice hefty spring. The, this gun itself kicks about 280 fps with a 0.2 gram BB. I got this gun off of Action Hobbies for £25, but it was the girlfriend who paid for it. Well, I'm really And... Um, this re rear side itself is adjustable. This top, it doesn't come off. Mm, that's pretty... That's a pretty powerful kick to it, so... Because when I've been shooting metal signs, I could actually hear it ping straight off the sign when I was hitting it. The, I'll go over a couple of things, a couple of problems I've found with that is if you're using, first off, if you're using 0 0.12, high quality 0.12 gram BBs, which my book I wouldn't recommend, the hop up works on it, it does have a hop up, the hop up right there, but with 0 0.2 gram BBs the hop up doesn't work. Go watch the feed lip here, because the feed lip is less, and I've had to <laughs> repair the feed lip. That's how it looks all chewed up, because at one point it wouldn't feed BBs. But apart from that, they're just two minor niggles. I'll come back in for this. It's got as I said about the sight, rear sight being adjustable. It's... Yeah, the accuracy is good, I think. <coughs> and I blow it today with 0 0.2 gram BBs. Can hit, but miss at the same time. As I found out. I mean, I've been personally shot with it, so I know how sore this one is, a 0 0.2 gram BB, it stings. Like fuck. Yep. <laughs> but mind you, I was foolish enough to allow myself to get shot with just a t-shirt on. I know, it was crying. I wasn't crying. You were. I wasn't. You were. But, the magazine... Sorry, that's me just gonna... Anyway. The magazine that comes along with the gun, is your typical 
AG high capacity magazine, but the capacity of the magazine that comes along with it is only 300 rounds instead of your normal high capacity magazines, which are about what, five, anywhere from 500 rounds up to 1000 rounds. Um, I do have ammo in it, but I've not winded it around at the bottom. And you put the ammo in there. You wind it at the bottom. And then you'll see the ammo up there, and then it's ready to feed. And to run itself. But with this, it's not your typical M4 cell slot it in, press button to release it. You, it's got a wee lap here, up at the top. What you do? Bomb and feed well. Get it in at the front first. You need to hook onto the lap. And that's it in. Ready to go. Now, it does have a safety and it does have markings for semi full auto, but as it is a spring gun, it only does semi automatic. The range is good, it's very good. And with a couple of, with a slight modification, a lower, like a short, shorter, mid capacity AK mag. And modification up at the top because it doesn't have the mount for the update to go on to. But with a slight modification to the top, you can put a rail on top of it, mount a scope on it. Now, Presso, instant sniper. But that's what I'd do and with an internal upgrade of type or barrel. The it's got a fake cleaning mud in the bottom of the barrel here. Basically, that's there for sure. You, you unscrew the screw up. There's a screw up here. It broke half up there, but there's a screw up there which allows you to take the entire front flash hider and front sight off. But as you can see, this gun is within the UK law of being two tone. Well, I'm here. I'll show you the first selector. Typical AK out up safe. This was an AG. It'd be down one for full auto. Then it would be down one more for semi-automatic. But as it's a spring rifle, it only goes safe where the full auto would be on an AG and real seal AK. And that's as far as it'll go down. And I can manipulate that with one. Finger for a fire selector switch, I can actually manipulate that with my trigger finger. The stock can not only can the stock unscrew, but it is hollow. Oh, yeah, and there is metal bits up there and down there to hold the stock in place with screws. There should be two screws at the bottom, but I can't get this, seem to get the one for the bottom, the other one for the bottom in. So I've got it screwed up there, and I've got it sc screwed in there. There is a weight running through the back of the stock, right there. But, this gun does have a bit of heft to it when you first get it, and if you're not used to it, it does have a wee bit of heft, but after a wee bit of time, you're just like messing around, playing with it, and you can just generally get used to it, it doesn't fetch you anymore, but that is pretty good gun at the end of the day. And personally myself, like I said, if you're going to modify this thing, tight board model, real, modify a reel on the top and for a scope. Short sub-air magazines, mid-capacities or low-caps. 
I'm just generally turning into a sniper. Something like that. Basically, but, but a couple of other facts about it before I wrap this up is that is one to one scale. And the gun itself is a nice gun. I'm happy with, with it for the fact that I do like the AK 47s. And because I bought you. Mm -hmm. and I'm just getting impressed with for, for a Simon Spring gun. The fact that it takes AG high caps is something on its own. And I never thought I'd generally do a video on the spring, rig, spring rifle, but. Uh, here it is. It's well balanced with the titan because the rest of the body is. That looks good. It's just like the bits it would be. The, the real seal wood on the real, real seal. They're just blue, blue bit. Just blue bit. Blue plastic, blah. Couldn't get the words out there. Is <laughs> that you? Um, that's when you got it up on this. Thanks for watching. Does hopefully there will be more videos in the future. And thanks for watching. And rate, comment, subscribe. And hope you hope you enjoy. Oh yeah, quick. I'll put when I put in the description when I find the description box when I'm uploading the video I'll put a link to the website that got it from. I'll let you know just now it was Asian Hobbies, but I'll also put a link in the description I think. As far as I remember it was twenty five pounds. But thanks for watching. More to come, rate, comment, subscribe. Stay safe, better sit, play yourself. And